Hello, guy. I'm the PM of the NAS for Ukraine. Well, so how's it going here? I see 184 terabytes. Yeah. What do you mean? Uh, it means that if you buy our eBay models, the maximum storage for you can reach is 184 terabytes. Yeah. But what if I need more? Need more? Okay, it's, it's, it's quite a lot. Yeah. So how's it going with the Ugreen NAS? Oh, it's very successful because we launched the uh, uh, Ugreen NAS product in the Kickstarter from uh, March to uh, May. We just finished this function. And with success? It's very successful because we accumulated six million US dollars in the six Kickstarter. Six million dollars, that's a lot of NAS. Yeah. Many, many. Yeah, we have sold over 1,000 pieces of the NAS in the Kickstarter. How much was this one on the Kickstarter, Dual Bay? Was this on Kickstarter? Yeah, is it in Kickstarter, Two Bay, yeah. How much is the price on Kickstarter? Uh, in Kickstarter, it depends on the discount of the early bird. If you can enjoy the 50, uh, uh, 50% or the 30%, 30 to 50% in the Kickstarter, maybe the price for you to uh, get in the Kickstarter is just around 200 to 300 US dollars. Yeah. Very affordable for NAS. And uh, how much was the 8B? Yeah, 8B? On the, on the Kickstarter. On the Kickstarters? Yeah, how much it was around? Uh, if you Five, can, six hundred? No. Yeah, if you can enjoy the discount in the Kickstarter, uh, just like the early bird I mentioned, uh, I think the, the price for you to get in the Kickstarter is just about uh, 1,000. 1,000? Yeah, 1,000. Right. Yeah. So uh, full retail price will be 2,000? Uh, 1,500? It will be 100, uh, it will be 1,500 in a retailer price, yeah. All right. And how about the four bay? The four bay? Price for this? Uh, for the four bay, it will be 600 for the retailing price, yeah. And uh, if I put this here, you can show around? Yeah, you okay. turn? Yeah. Yeah, in the front, you can see the SD card slot, and you also the uh, Type-C port, and also the USB-C port. And behind, you can see there are two LAN ports. Yeah, both of them are the 2.5 gigabit. Yeah, and you can see other USB slots here. So the expansion is very wonderful. Yeah. What do you do with HDMI? Yeah, for the HDMI, you can output the content stored in your NAS to the TV, so you can enjoy a full screen. Yeah. Is it running on Linux? Yeah, it's based on the Linux. Yeah. Everything Intel. Yeah. Intel CPU. Yeah, because we have a long intern we have a long partnership with the Intel, so the Intel will provide us with the uh, stronger CPU to support our uh, higher performances compared with the other competitors. Yeah. Is it stable software? Yeah, we it's very new product, but it's already stable now. Yeah, uh, our our developers are always uh, trying their best to uh, enhance the quality of our software we do we have done different measures to ensure the stability of our software the first one uh, we we put more developer to ensure the, the security uh, stability of our software and secondly we have just finished our uh, overseas uh, beta test program to ensure we can find out more bugs of our software and then we can enhance our user experience when they get a press new NAS, yeah. Um, you don't have any plan to use ARM CPU? Um, for this question, uh, because uh, we have a long partnership with uh, Intel, so for the other competitor, I don't, think, uh, I don't think this year we, we can talk about this. Maybe in the future we can uh, we can look for other uh, cooperation, but for this for this moment, Intel is uh, our very important partner. We will because uh, when yeah. I see Ugreen, right, the brand, yeah, there's no Intel here. Uh, but if you visit, only in us. But if you visit the the exhibition in the CES, you can see we shift the cooperation uh, with the Intel, so you can see the Intel logo in the CES uh, exhibition. But for this exhibition, because the topic is different, so we have uh, other uh, product lines such as the cable chargers. But for the NAS, we achieved the cooperation with the Intel, so there is no doubt that we have a strong CPU. Yeah. All right. Um, 
the guys on Kickstarter, yeah. did they ask you to have more functionality, extra feature? Or you will have all the feature everybody wants? Uh, you mean the new features or the new functions? People ask new feature or they're happy with everything? Yeah. yeah because, what do you want? Yeah, because user are curious about how is it going in the future and our team is always committed to uh, developing and, and providing more apps they can use. So in the uh, uh, quarter three and quarter four, we will uh, publish more apps for them to use, uh, such as the uh, like the, the the brand new the file manager, the file new the the Docker, the file new the download uh, tools. So they can look forward to that. Nice. Uh, did you have a lot of guys on YouTube make a review about this, right? Yeah, we had some guys test it. Yeah, because we send our units to many KOL, to many YouTubers, they create a lot of video to talk about our NAS. Yeah, it's our pressure to work with them. Yeah. Everybody like it? Yeah. Somebody said there was a problem, or nobody said there was any problem? Mm. Yeah, I think I don't think uh, every piece of product is perfect. So uh, if someone say there's something wrong with our product, we will listen to it and we will try to overcome the, the problems. We will try our best to enhance our user experience to meet their requirement. Yeah, to, to make them happy, yeah. So here is a 2.5G, 2.5G. Is yeah. it the same here? Oh, oh it's so the eBay, the hardware configuration is better because uh, both of them are 10 gigabit infinite LAN port, yeah. So 20 total. Yeah, so if you want to uh, maximize the, the speed of the transmission, you can make full use of the two LAN ports, yeah. And uh, what do you put here? Oh, it is the PCIe slot for you to expand uh, your NAS to other external devices. Yeah, yeah, you can uh, add other devices to make it more uh, very helpful, just like the uh, network card or the G uh, GPU card and other devices. Yeah, we provide a PCIe slot for you to keep the expandability. Yeah, uh, is it possible to add a box next to it? For eight more? Yeah, you mean. If I want 16 bay. 16 bay? Can I add eight more or need to buy a second one? Uh, if you want to add more storage, maybe you can uh, use the external hard drives to get connected to the NAS. But for this one, uh, if you don't use other uh, ports or you um, you don't change the, the structure of the NAS, all you can use is A-Bay. But you can also install the two M.2 SSD into the M.2 slot to uh, add up the storage uh, besides the SATA HDD. Yeah. So uh, I, love, I love a new concept, I, I, maybe it's not so new, uh, it's called the Renew, Renewed HDD. Yeah. You know, the second hand market for HDD. Like uh, maybe Alibaba, Tencent, Google, Amazon, mm. other companies sell their old hard disk on the market very cheap. Yeah. And I love the idea to put them here. I put a lot of second hand hard disk. If one break, it's not a big deal, change. It's oh. a RAID, right? RAID yeah. 5. And then you can, um, do you know what I mean? Oh, I, don't, I know. I know. Yeah. Do a lot of your customers buy second hand hard disk? Uh, for the hard disk, because we always do some compatibility uh, tests uh, for the hard disk, so if the consumer can buy the hard disk from this website, and this website could be passed the, could be uh, could be passing the test uh, within our team, I think they can use the hard disk in our NAS very uh, safely. Yeah, but just make sure the the hard disk uh, they bought could be compatible with our NAS. Yes, we will list the compatibility in uh, HDD and S SSD list in our official website, so uh, everyone can check this before they buy the uh, HDD or SSD. Yeah. Do you have very excellent software for backup solution, for cloud backup, for everything? 
Oh, okay. Uh, the first one, we have an app called uh, Synchronization and Backup. So if you want to uh, synchronize your files or backup your files to the remote server or, or to another NAS, you can use that app. And if you want to keep the synchronization between your NAS and the public cloud, just like the OneDrive, we also have the uh, we also have the tool called the network uh, network disk tool. So by using this tool, you can keep uh, synchronization between the OneDrive and the NAS. So that is no worry for you to to think about how you can transfer the data uh, stored in your public cloud to the NAS. Yeah. And all the Kickstarter backer received the product. Everybody already received. Yes, uh, they they just received our product uh, a few days ago because today is the uh, June the fifth. So I mean, uh, maybe they just uh, received uh, some of the products two or three days ago. Yeah. And everybody's happy. Um, maybe nobody's saying, "Hey, uh, why is so fast? Or why is so slow? Or uh, it's not work or something?" Because uh, for this moment, I'm in the exhibition in Taiwan, so you don't uh, check if, the you, last if you want to know more details about that ticket, I think when I get back to the Shenzhen, I can ask for my uh, colleagues to know more details about that feedback. Yeah. So your product, how is compared with uh, QNAP and uh, Synology? Oh, okay. There are several things to say. We have some uh, advantage. The first one, we have a long partnership with the Intel. So at the same price level, uh, we can provide a stronger CPU compared with our competitor. The second one in, is that uh, at the same price level, we can provide more uh, expandability because you can see there are more slots for you to expand the, the NAS to uh, expand the, expand the, the NAS to get connected to the other devices, just like the SD card, the, the uh, Thunderbolt, the USB-C, and you can also see the HDMI, LAN port, and other USB-C ports. 2.5? Yeah, 2.5. Uh, no, uh, for the 6 bay it's not 2.5, it's the 10. It's 10 gigabit LAN port. So 20, 20 gigabit totally? Yeah, 20 gigabit for the uh, DSPs, uh, 6,800 Pro, yeah. And this is the lowest cost? This is low cost that you have? Yeah, the cheapest one, right? Yeah, because it's the two base, so the performance is is different from the six base. Yeah. Is this two point five? Yeah, this is two point five. Yeah. And uh, this is there's a pro and a not pro, right? Uh, for the two uh, for two thousand and eight hundred one. Uh, for the model uh, we launch in, we launch into the public, it's just normal one, DSP two thousand and eight hundred. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so looking forward to see what people will say online about this. Uh, maybe it could be a very big market for you, Green, in the future. Yeah, we will, we will plan to go into more markets if the feedback is good, because uh, NAS uh, is a good solution for people's uh, storage. We hope NAS can solve their problem to help them store more files, to help them manage their files, and, uh, and, uh, and live a good life, yeah.